Asthma has been a major cause of concern for people of all ages around the world. With the increasing amount of allergens and rising air pollution in cities around the world, it is no less than an ever-growing pandemic. Seasonal changes and winter especially pose a gruesome challenge to people already suffering from asthma. Not to forget the continuously growing new cases of asthma each year in all age groups. Hello and welcome to another video of Ingenious Ayurveda. And in today's video, we are going to discuss Ayurvedic treatment for asthma. Friends, asthma is really a serious disease, which can be understood by just looking at some of the facts and figures. According to WHO, each year roughly 339 million people suffer from asthma. It is a common non-communicable disease among children. Approximately 7,918 deaths occurred due to asthma in 2016. Also, asthma is a public health concern that is not only limited to just high-income countries, rather it is prevalent in all countries regardless of the level of development. Most asthma-related mortality cases occur in low and lower middle-income countries. If asthma is left underdiagnosed and undertreated, it creates considerable burden on individuals and society because of the compromised productivity offered by the individual. Friends, asthma is also known as Tamak Swasa in ancient Ayurvedic science. It is again caused due to the imbalance of three doshas known as Vata, Pitta and Kapha. The Tamak Swasa is caused due to an increase in cough. The main reason being coming into contact with air containing dust, irritant gases, pollens or smoke using cold water and residing in cold and damp places. According to Ayurveda, there are three types of asthma based on the doshas. These are air element or also known as dry type asthma, fire element known as infection type asthma and water element known as congestion type asthma. In this condition, people can experience breathlessness and wheezing characterized by acute conditions and causing great affliction to the vital health. The practitioners of Ayurveda can easily confirm the condition by a detailed case history of the patient along with the dosha imbalance. Diagnosis is made based on the symptoms which are dependent on the location of morbid dosha and the nature of the pathology. The main aim is to remove the obstruction of respiratory passage by eliminating the kapha. The process is known as Srota Shuddhi is emphasized for removing the bronchial blockage caused by an imbalance in vata. Also, the kapha should be liquefied first by massaging medicated oils and rock salt all over the chest. The patients are recommended the drugs and diet which has the property of kapha, vridhikara dravya or also known as mucolysis so that the obstruction kapha can be easily thrown out. Ayurvedic medicine for asthma bronchitis is asthomap which is one of the best Ayurvedic medicine for allergy and asthma. Asthomap is a herbal formulation that aids in building immunity and lowering the intensity and frequency of asthma attacks. The herbal remedy is fit for all ages and has no side effect. There are some other Ayurvedic remedies for asthma as well. You can make use of these simple remedies that are easily available at your home. One of them is ginger. Ginger is a useful and commonly used herb when it comes to dealing with inflammation. You can mix the ginger eggs, 2 to 3 crushed garlic cloves that offer a very effective remedy for kapha. For kapha release, thereby giving relief in asthmatic attacks. The other remedy is ginger and turmeric milk. You can also make the simple ginger and turmeric milk and consume it twice a day. This is an all-natural remedy to lower asthmatic attacks, especially in winters and seasonal changes. The other remedies are cinnamon and honey. This is also an easy and simple remedy that can be taken twice a day. Just add 1 teaspoon of cinnamon and 1 4 teaspoon of trika 2 into a cup of boiling water. Allow this mixture to boil for some time and add honey before drinking. You may also try Muleti or also known as Licorice and Ginger and Bay Leaf and Pipli. Muleti also offers an anti-inflammatory effect for asthma patients. You can combine it with ginger extract and consume it on a regular basis. While Bay Leaf and Pipli also helps. 
You can also use bay leaf and pipli on regular basis. This will also help you tackle kapha and give you relief. We hope this information is helpful and give you some relief from asthma. To get extraordinary result, we recommend you to meet an Ayurvedic doctor or an expert so you can recover from this respiratory disease. Till then, bye.